Hey guys, looking at your back at again with another video. So in this video, I'll be showing you how to get a web browser for your Nintendo Switch. For this video, all you would need is a modern Nintendo Switch and to be connected to a Wi-Fi network. When you're connected to a Wi-Fi network, you want to make sure you're off airplane mode because you want to be off airplane mode when downloading it, but you want to go back onto airplane mode after downloading it so you don't get banned. Make sure when you're on airplane mode though, you have Wi-Fi enabled so you can access the internet. So when you're here, you want to go into your homebrew menu. For me, it's this Wii right here. So we're going to click until we get to the Wii menu and we're going to press the Wii button and we're brought up into the homebrew menu. Over here, you want to go into the homebrew app store and we would want to launch it. We will launch it. We're going to be brought up here and it takes a second to load because it's going to be compiling all the games and you want to once again make sure you're connected to the internet. Otherwise, this will not work. When you're here, you're going to get brought up to this section over here and sometimes it might just show, sometimes it might not. But for me, for example, it didn't work. So we're going to go into search and what you would just want to search for is just browser. So we're going to search browser. And once you're here, you're just going to be brought up to this. It's going to take a second to load. And you'll see all of these icons here that haven't been loaded. But this is the one you want to install. Browser NX. Once you click this, you just want to press A and you want to install it. It doesn't take too long to install. And as you can see, it says reloading metadata. It just takes like, honestly, 10, 15 seconds to download. Once you're here, you're going to be brought up back to the home screen you want to just press the home button go back to the home screen and you just want to launch a game so for me i'm going to close mario and let me relaunch it now when launching the game you want to make sure you're holding your r trigger right here this one you just want to hold the r shoulder button so you just want to press and hold it you want to launch the game press and hold it and we're brought back up to the homeroom menu now when you're in the homeroom menu you want to keep on going until you find your browser. So we're going to open it up right here by pressing A. And if you get this, don't worry. It takes a second to load. Nothing to worry about. Nothing's wrong. But once you're over here, you're going to get the cert security certificate. So what you would want to do is you want to want to go to triangle and try again. Now, I'm going to press this again and let's see minus so when you're here you just want to press minus i'm using a controller because my thing doesn't work but when you're here you simply just want to press minus and then you'll be brought up to google if google doesn't work you just want to press plus and it will reset it thoroughly and it should work so that is pretty much it for this video now if this doesn't work over here what you would want to do is you want to press the home button and you want to go onto the Wii menu and you don't need to launch a game but it's better to launch a game because you get more memory when you're here we're just going to press browser one more time let's do it as you can see running in applet mode you need to hold a game as you can see hold an hour trigger and it should work so this was a quick little video that i made and that's it for this video if you have any questions and if this does not work for you after holding minus then let me know send a message in my discord server and someone in my team can help you if you want to learn how i used a playstation controller though for this whole video or any controller honestly send me a message or send a comment on this video and i'll make the video soon thank you for watching and yeah